Hello everybody, I'm Master Rolfus, it's time to play another game of Planetary Annihilation. Today we have a 10 player for fall, blah 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 blah, all that usual jazz and mumbo jumbo that you usually hear in the beginnings of all of my recordings. Now, we do have two new plans for day today. We have I'm a Dinosaur, which is a Nerf planet. It doesn't really look like a dinosaur, but that's okay. He can be whatever the hell he wants, or she wants, the planet... Is a dinosaur and I love it and you too shall love it as well and then we have milk over here which is our resident metal plant now usually I do probably go for about I don't know five or four vehicle factories then afterwards get a tier two factory and try to dominate this planet and afterwards get into a long grueling conflict over uh, orbital space in order to try and uh, secure the metal planet or the moon or I guess maybe a another earth planet and defeat the opponent who has full control over that area and that's usually how my games go down, right? Well, today I'm saying no. I am saying no to that. You know what? We're gonna go away ahead and probably just go to the metal planet as soon as we can. That's, that's what we're gonna do. That's gonna be the game plan. We're gonna reach the moon and beyond. So what does this mean? Well, that means we're going to set up a uh, base, uh, base site ground zero right over here. Take as many of the mexes as we possibly can. Build up tons of defenses. Build up some walls. Build up some... Uh, what was it? Some I guess factories to try and get some production going on this planet. Then afterwards, we're fucking on, we're fucking on over to the milk over here. And that's pretty much the game plan. Cause I'm I'm tired. I'm tired of fighting a a two hour duel to the death over a metal planet or a metal planet or a moon planet. Well, actually, not moon planet. God damn it! I'm a moon essentially, or an asteroid, whatever you want to call it. I guess it could be called the moon planet because it's all by itself and not orbiting anything, but whatever. So we have blue over there. And usually I would probably go ahead and build some ants to kill blue, but no. No. Instead, we get out the orbital factory and leave. We will leave as soon as possible. Actually, you know what we could do? We could set up a base at ground zero right over here and afterwards set up a little base over here on the metal planet and have two bases at the same time. We don't have to abandon one for the other. I might be. I'm a silly goose, I guess. Wait, away, Because it's only blue, I feel a little bit safe, actually. Very, very safe. Let's go ahead and speed up the construction of the orbital factory. Go ahead and get it as straight as soon as possible. Or an orbital lander is what's apparently being called now. And afterwards, we can stack up the holy moly of orbital fabbers. We don't need to get out um, mexes so fast. We can just slowly, slowly keep producing mexes with just one fabricator. We don't need three or two fabricators on mexes. We're not starving for mechs, or we're not starving for energy at all either. Pretty good. Girl, you got me twisted. What the hell? Why did we get an adventure? Eh. Oh, well. Let's go ahead and get another vehicle factory. Just to continue production. Come on, now the Astraeus time. Whoa! Are you guys not gonna build your Astraeus? That, that is just weird as balls. Should probably also get some spinners rolling. Huh, how do you get those maxes? What's going on? What you dig you're doing, huh? What you dig you're doing? You little scallywag. Alright, get out of Deep Space Radar, and then time for the Astraeus. Probably speed up the construction of this race. Oh, hello there. And we do see Black. Yep, Black's going for the same idea. Hold on a sec. Let me go deny him. You guys can go on energy plan duty. We can pick up the commander like so. Um, what? No, pick up the commander, friend Arena. Yeah, there we go. We do unfortunately need some bot fabricators rolling out. And we can probably unload over here. Alright, pretty good stuff. Now, who's leaving with me? Hmm, that would be probably black over there. 
There are tons of commanders actually trying to leave. Holy crap. This is a little bit crazy to say at least. This idea, this plan is used a lot more frequently than I assumed. Which kind of highlights the, I guess the, um, what was it, the popularity orbital strategies have on Planetary Annihilation, which is good. I mean, Planetary Annihilation is a game about orbital air and land warfare. Not all land, not all land. Then again, though, and this is important, I kind of wish orbital was fixed up a little bit more. Make it a little bit more accessible. Well, not accessible, but I'd rather have transportation between orbital spears a little bit more organic, I guess. Now then, all these people are starting to really grind on my gears. Mobile fabrics, you guys can speed up the construction of the energy plants. Commander will soon be over there in base site alpha. Probably stop building spinners for now. So we have about 10 spinners, so we don't really need that many. God, I really hate the fact that as soon as our energy stops, we just get completely bamboozled by, I guess, um, notification after notification. All right, then let's go ahead and set up some air factories because we're going to try and get control of this area pretty darn fast. And I'm probably going to move on forward and attack Blue because right now he's just... He's just scouting too much. He knows too much. Nope. I don't trust him one bit. Now, where's that black commander? Oh, we just landed. Oh, yeah. I also got a mod that changed up the uh, projectile. I guess. Uh, yeah, I guess the projectile graphics quite a bit. I was gonna say it also changed up something else, but no, nope, it did not change anything else. That's pretty good. Ooh, yellow has a pretty huge base. Already, I feel pretty darn weak actually from going on to, I guess, focusing mostly on orbital over here. Like abandoning my main base and stuff. I, I felt a little bit more comfortable on my main base. But I guess I gotta get out of my comfort zone. You always do need to do that. These are anti-air suffice. That's pretty good. That does make me feel a little bit happy. Oh, I'm proud to be an American. Na 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 na. So blue has done nothing but spam out turrets after turrets after turrets. This is yeah not gonna end well for him because then I could just spam out turrets after turrets after turrets and take him out. And what I should do is probably get some spinners to try and defend my base against any attacks. Because even though I don't care about it, I still don't want to lose the base. Let's go ahead and set up some more air factories right over here. I guess at this point we can go for that tier two. Wow, really? Did you? Oh my, that is pathetic. Okay. I can't. Like really, really now. That is just. That is just balls to the wall, sad. Man, I'm already doing a terrible job on this planet. I know I'm doing a terrible job. Focusing on my attention on two areas is a little bit difficult. Especially when one guy decides to essentially pronounce tower defense as his lord and savior. Alright, well, I'm going to go ahead and get some shellers right now and basically crap on his base. So unless he can build shellers pretty darn soon, he'll be out of the job. God, I need to fucking fix this shit up. 
Like, I really need to focus a little bit more. I wonder why my commenters say that your orbit always does suck. It, it does. It does. I would say it's probably the worst thing about my play. That in my hindsight, that's even worse. But at least I know, oh, not to spam out turret defenses. Because then someone could just spam out a bunch of shellers and ruin your day. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and get out of teleporter really fast and help speed up the construction of base side alpha. Let's go ahead and get some hum um, bumblebees over here because I do want to try and secure my position in this area. Unfortunately, the shellers do like to not attack certain areas. I have forgotten about that. Hey, you lot can go ahead and get out that teleporter right over here. Good, let's go get some advanced fabricators going out. And so far, we will be able to kill Blue. It's just a matter of time. And he's basically shot himself into this um, position. Oh, what black spawn right next to me? That's weird. I don't know why black spawn right next to me. That's just, that's just balls to the wall. Strange. Did he know it was there? Uh, probably not. Probably just a coincidence. Still, that is that is strange as balls. Uh, come on, pelters, do your dirty work. Just gonna save up some bombies right about now. Like the tier two mechs is set up, and let's go get some advanced fabricators rolling out so that we can. Try and do some crazy shit involving. Oh crap. Yo, it's coming in to attack us. That's not good. Yep, this is what I get for focusing too much on too many stuff at the same time and also not doing a good job at it. Granted, though, I will be able to kill Blue, which is good. Well, let's continue getting you, and Commander, I would like it if you went down here and just built, I don't know, mass arrays of power plants. Seems like yellow is going up north. That's pretty good for me. Let's go ahead and continue building up tier one factories. You guys can speed up the production of those fabricators over there. Come on, Blue. The end is nigh. Yeah, like honestly, you just cannot do master. They don't. They don't work. They never do work. Oh, another commander. Where? I'm hunting you down. I am so hunting your ass down. Oh my god. We can send in the horde of bombies right about now. To black. Hmm. 
don't know where Black Commander went, but he didn't win somewhere. Ain't that much. Or exactly? Nobody knows. Nobody knows. Oh crap. Great. Well. Oh. What the fuck? <laughs> I don't have any AA. So now he's just reclaiming my shit. Oh my god. What a shit lord. Oh. That is hilarious. And now he's gonna come in on my flank. Yep, look at that. I gotta really focus a lot more on my stuff. Alright, let's go ahead and get some tier 2. I do love the pretty projectiles though, they are really nice looking. Well, rawfulness is learning. Rawfulness is learning, kids. As soon as you're done with that, go ahead and give me some energy storage and some storage we already have like advanced mexes here but we can get a little bit more okay this is a lot better why didn't I do this come on rawfulness come on Why are you such a buffoon I am not playing to the best of my ability I will Agree to the highest extent of the law that I am doing terribly because I'm not used to playing like this Yeah, he's basically done for most of his army is docks based anyway, isn't it? Well, he has boom bots, but those don't help anybody. No, let's just let's just focus in on the commander. Ooh, those shadow volleys! I love the projectile mods so much now. It makes everything look really, really pretty. Now then, let's focus on this area, because this area is lacking quite a bit, in like everything. So first and foremost, go ahead and attack Blue, because he's a douche. Second of all, go ahead and get all those tier 2 mechs. We can get some umbrellas for you. In fact, let's put up and make our umbrellas like basically all over the place. Sorry, man, but you should have spent less on towers. A lot less. Okay, try to get all those mechs to set up. This is a way better mode. Holy crap. My god, this is amazing. Amazing! Oh? Oh. I didn't know that. Well, you know what? Hmm. First and foremost, let's back off you over here. We could continue to snipe, but... Why did my radar seem, actually? Yeah, I have enough energy. That's, that's weird. Alright, let's back off a little bit. Yeah, I just realized that we're gonna kind of get a little bit sandwiched if we're not careful. With the forces of yellow and... Brown and everybody. Let's go ahead and get some storage. Yeah, 
And I'm just gonna back off my forces for now. I don't really like the fact that yellow's over here up north. And I don't like the fact that brown has built up a massive amount of forces. I'm gonna go ahead and get some gillies really quick. Oh, there's a commander over there. Could just snipe him. In fact, I'm gonna go ahead and do so. Let's go ahead and build some more vehicle factories over here. Still can't see anything. That's weird. Oh, whatever. I don't see any tier 2 from yellow at all. Yeah, this is gonna be a slaughter. Well, let me let me retract that statement. I do see tier two. I don't see a massive amount of it. Like, look at my shallow army compared to his ant army. That's what I'm trying to say. Okay, you guys go ahead and get me some more air factories right about now. Yeah, this is pretty much easy peasy lemon squeezy at this point. Oh, he's setting up a slammer attack. Oh, okay. God, when I'm not on the offensive all the time, these guys really do like do stack up against me. Might be a little bit paranoid over here, but they do stack up. They're basically like zombies. You have to kill them over and over and over again, otherwise they just go out of control. And look at this army coming in from white over here. That's crazy. You know what's funny though, this orbital plan has actually given me a lot more resources to utilize. So it is extremely fucking useful in that regard. Um, I didn't build enough ants, I guess. So what you're seeing right now is the lack of ants coming in. Probably due to my low ass efficiency. Oh, and now white's coming in. Okay, we probably lost this planet actually, but that's okay because I got another planet. Maybe now focusing on one planet at a time would be pretty darn good for me. Now we were gonna get wrecked anyway though, we didn't have the production. Well, we did, but I neglected it quite a bit. It was my fault. We can maybe survive this. It, it definitely does depend on how much I can keep my shellers alive and rebuild my army. Again, though, this planet isn't really my top concern at the moment, I guess. I wish the catapults would kind of focus fire on more higher tier troops, actually. If I can be totally honest. Poor job of holding down his units. Granted, I don't think a lot of my shoulders are actually firing. Yeah, I think that's the Gillies, however, doing the damage, doing the dirty work, the nasty. Yellow being attacked at the same time as well? That would explain why Yellow has slowed down his advance quite a bit. Yeah, I guess. Which is good, for fuck's sake. I'm tired of getting attacked at once by like three different people. It is, it is not attractive.
Okay, there's Black's home base. Hold on a sec. I'm going to do a little bit of a scouting run. Well, not Black, but Brown's home base. I'm going to do a little bit of a scouting run, see what Brown is planning. Go ahead and get out another energy plant. No, get away. We don't need another... What? I, I don't... I don't get it. Like, do you think I can see that? Oh, I can see this too. Okay, now I'm going to check out and see. Maybe I have enough bone bees for this massive sniper run I plan on doing. Come on, show me what I need to see. And so far... Huh. Well. Okay, then. Hmm. That's a little bit bad, to say the least. He's not on this planet. He's on the other planet. He's on this one. Wait, who built an Essex? That'd be purple. Thank God we have umbrellas in the area. Yeah, our hummingbird built up has been surprisingly well so far for us. And yellow's dead. Yellow is completely dead, and thank God for that. But then again, destroying his entire army would do that. So I guess now we can kind of move our forces over here for the most part. There we go. Focus on our efforts are dealing with orange. And now we have brown to worry about. Hmm. How to deal with brown? Well, I guess first and foremost, we should go ahead and get some orbital out. Got an orbital radar. Try to build up and see where brown's nucleus is. And you know what? I'm going to actually take some of my fabrics and build up some umbrellas. Just in case anything bad happens. While also getting out an anti-nuke. Okay, good. It's probably about time we actually send in the majority of our forces right now over to Brown's base. Probably like it if we built some T2 bots. Hmm, advanced spot factory. Okie dokie. What's your plan, Brown? You know what I could do? Take up two birds with one stone. Brown's army is on my my metal planet over here. But it's also on this planet. So what I could do is just kill both. Or try to kill both. Which I can do. I have the forces. So let's go ahead and move forward. Heck, if Brown wants to mess, Brown will mess. Right now, I'm not going to get out any catalysts. I know some people are probably like, why aren't you getting catalysts? But I'm not going to get it because... That will set an alarm to everybody saying, oh, hey, everybody, this fuckwit is trying to end the game. Stop him. And I don't need to get, like, triple, quadruple, or pentic teamed. Especially since I'm pretty much sucking so far in my play. Hmm... I don't think any of them really wants to move forward and try to attack the other. Let me catapult detected. Where would the catapult be? Oh, it's right over there. So you're just building up tons of defenses, White. You're not really doing much. 
I'm gonna probably go in hot and try to take you out. In fact, I'm just gonna take out your Hornet army really quick. Yep, there we go. In fact, let's just send in my forces right now. Why not? Get stomped. Oh god, are you serious? Why are the devil and I don't know the Archduke Ferdinand going in and trying to circle me both at the same time? What's going on? Nope, I can't do that. I gotta shit, I have to fight fucking white, but I also gotta fight brown otherwise brown is gonna be too much of a pain in the tush yeah, let's get a laser platform going hmm, let's see let's see you're still about good. You're still chilling about. Keep firing, keep firing. Now for this battle, we should probably go in hot right now. Take out Brown's only way of escaping. Actually, on second thought, cancel the laser platform. I do need to see everything at all times. You're rolling in blind like this is not a good idea. God, I feel squeezed right now. Like an anaconda has me. The anaconda would be both white and brown. Anaconda don't. My Anaconda don't. My Anaconda don't want none unless you got buns, hon. Huh? Alright, Bombees. Go forth and melt the space away. No, yes, maybe. How about we just back you guys off? Focus on white. I'm gonna focus in on this battle a little bit. Hmm. Right now, I think we destroyed the majority of the fighters. We just need to move in our forces right now that are land based. Try to crush Brown that way. Yeah, that's not good. Oh, is there nobody else on this planet? No, there's just me and Brown. Me and Brown Town over here. My god, players you do this are annoying. Just capitulate! You have no units, why do you run? And he's gonna build catapults too. Yeah, this should do tons of damage. It did do a lot of damage, but he just has 
tons of units. Also, we didn't back up our guys with hummingbirds, which we really should have. Well, that's okay. Let's build some more factories. A little bit closer to the front lines, albeit. White, you are incredibly annoying. Oh well. We just need to produce a little bit more, then we should be fine. White does have an anti nuke, so a nuke isn't going to work out. Your orange is poised to attack me. That's not good. Oh, okay. Well. None of this is particularly good. We have a failed invasion of brown over here. We have a failed invasion of white. I think what I'm going to do is. Cut my losses, go after, I guess, brown. Hope to God that yellow doesn't attack, orange doesn't attack me now. Be a tough one, all right. Oh, there's a flag turret over there. Thank God we're building hornets really, really fast. Otherwise, I would have said, "Damn, we lost." Nah, this this white thing is really insulting. And now Orange is going to come in and attack us. Okay. So you know what? We now know that Orange is a douche. Yeah, this is certain. But. But. If we can kill Black. I mean not Black. Brown. Basically force him on the Metal Planet. We have a good shot of winning. Let's continue the push against Brown. Where are your commanders? Why do you have all of your AA there? Where is your commander anyway? Don't tell me he's on this planet. Is he on this planet? Oh my god, the fact that my units are slowed down. My other air units is a little bit ridiculous. Alright, Princess Dougish, move on over. More anti nukes. Where is your dudes? Who's your daddy and what does he do? Oh my golly. Okay, so Brown's not even on the metal planet. Well, I mean, he is on the metal planet. He's just extremely far away from... No, 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 yeah. He's, he's not actually extremely far away either. He's on the metal plant, but he's basically right next door. Where my radar doesn't reach, which explains a lot. Good god, man. Where's your commander? Where does he... these advanced energy plants. We're on a time limit against the uh, forces of orange. Did orange build nothing but doxes? Oh my god, I thought these were ants. This now changes everything. I'm moving in. Really? That is pa Oh my god. I just, I just saw the nuke. He's gonna use it against me. There's something you should never do. Ok, 
God, if I knew these were all doxes, I wouldn't have been so hesitant to send in forces. I feel really dumb now. Okay. Continue building up units. Come on, come on. Let's stop building fabrics for now. Just build hummingbirds. Right now, I guess the best thing I'm trying to do is damage control. Let's see how much damage I can do against Brown. Kill him off and survive this whole encounter. is completely abandoned this space. Oh no, he does have ants and spinners and all other types of shit going in this unit um, unit dog pile. Okay, so right now I'm merely just trying my damnedest to hold back the tide of orange. supposed to build buildings right all right we're waiting for people okay well let's go ahead and continue getting air factories I guess because those are kind of working With orange's army now being pushed back I feel a little bit more comfortable to actually take on his forces for now however I gotta I gotta do I gotta do what needs to be done Horde type of legends, Brown, you are going down. See you in hell, Slimo. Phew, okay, finally we got that. Oh, that was difficult as balls. Okay, first things first. Take my hornets and patrol the planet constantly. Same with the hummingbirds. black out of the way oh well not black with brown on the way I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to take all of my air fabbers that's right all of them and take them to the catalyst we're gonna start preparing our metal planet for an easy snipe we're well, not an easy snipe but a semi easy snipe go ahead and also get a nuke Phew. Okay. Wow. That was that is difficult. As you can see, I'm I'm pretty damn dumb at this game. Okay. I, I'm pretty damn newbie. Especially when it comes to orbital. Granted, though, some of the things that the players do are really strange. I mean, really. There's still an over reliance on what was it? Doxes, which is still weird. Like, honestly, doxes are pretty bad still. Maybe in 1v1s they're not, but that's only one case. It seems like orange is backed off. That means I'm allowed to basically go in on white. Let's assemble a ton of units right now. Okay, so tons of catapults. Mass defenses, that is I don't know I don't know what to say to that. Like, I mean you guys know my opinion about mass defenses. I think they're dumb because like they don't work out since you can just build shelters and stuff like that. Holy fuck, a giant fucking wasp went into my room. Yeah, that's not good. Oh well we'll worry, we'll worry about it later. Feel very protected now that air units are constantly patrolling my my territory. Let's go ahead and stop land unit production for now. Okay, 
probably get these guys going on a teleporter. Get all of Air Fabrics moved on forward here. Come on, everybody, just build me that nuke. All right, white. It's time for you to smell the roses. Smell the damn roses. All right, then moving hot. Except for the laser platforms. You guys can probably go a little bit back. Back, no, no, no. Don't do that. Let's nuke it first. Nuke it first. Just sit tight and relax. Uh, and all my units, you can dogpile on. Over to the teleporter. Where did the teleporter go? Oh, it's destroyed. Okay. Do I have any more air units anymore? I don't- I can't even tell. No, I don't, but I do have laser platforms, and those are good enough, I guess. Oh, I do have air units. Good. Let's go ahead and build some air factories over here, and some air factories over here. I love how this is his only strategy to use air units like this. I gotta lie though, it's a pretty effective strategy. God, Castros do so little damage. Wow. I didn't actually notice that. That's weird. I always thought that you would do a little bit more. Eh, oh well. How did Nuke go, by the way? Oh, it's still coming. Okay, so never mind. Don't do anything yet. Hopefully, you can teleport fighters over. I'll make the world a whole lot more better. Where are my laser platforms? Hey, there we go. Ooh, lovely area effectability. Take my fucking piercing wands. Taste it. Taste it and love it. Okay, there goes the nuke. Too late. Moving it on. How many air fibers do we have? Quite a bit. We're gonna go ahead and set up those catalysts that mommy and daddy were talking about. So far, I think we've emptied out most of my land units. I'm gonna keep a lion's share of my land units alive just so that I can get out some more stuff. What I mean by stuff, I mean by some more military units, just in case something bad happens. Insurance is what I'm trying to say. You guys killed that casual, thank you. Now, purple. Orange and white don't get their act together soon. I will nuke them. You know this kind of remind this really is a massive deja vu or a lighting moment like this is basically What I deal with on a daily basis like I've become my own worst enemy. I Am my end my worst enemy. Holy crap. I am what I am Look at me. I'm, I'm a philosopher. I'm a philosopher as this shit put it on YouTube Just master of the stinks
Okay, I think we can stop with air production. For the time being, we'll just stop production. Let's just do everything. Without production. Oh. Excuse me there, sir. I'm, s I'm sorry, I... Kill blue. That's mean. That was extremely mean. Extremely hurtful. Who was that? Was that white? That was purple. Yep, that's what happens when you put up the catalyst. Everybody's gonna come after your ass now. Here, I will set up some umbrellas really quick. And we're gonna have to go back onto military production. Get some gunships. Yes, they really are the best thing to get. And get some mombies. Ooh, that was a massive spin. Alright then. How's everything going? Well, we've carved our way through a massive chunk of purple. I don't know where it ends and I don't know where it begins because purple seems to have decided that the Great Wall of China was the best wonder in the world. It isn't. It probably is like anger wad or something. I'm, I'm. Look at me being a hipster. It's an endless amount of catapults. That's my issue right now. Just the endless bombardment of catapult missiles is ridiculous. Like, come on, dude. Why? Why must you hate my catapults so? Send over some Avengers to help out. We're going in blind right about now, so that's not exactly a good thing. And then again, it's the best thing we could do. There! Oh my god, take him out! For the love of god, how do you build that many defenses? Do we have any vehicle fabrics? No, we don't. Do we have tons of bot fabrics? So let's go ahead and get some here to bot factories. Oh my god, we're not going to be able to beat them. Uh, beat them back. You want to know why? That's because he has way too many defenses. Look at this crap. It's just ridiculous how many defenses he has. Wow. You can constantly keep cleaving your way through his base. But there are just so many defenses that it doesn't even matter. And now Purple is basically calling on a crusade. Which to his credit, he's doing it. Decent job of calling. Actually, never mind. Yeah, he's. What? You're a giant douche! Holy shit! Like, I'm sorry if, like, White's looking at this, but I mean, come on, man. What? There should be a catapult limit. Like, there should really be a limit to how many catapults you can and should produce. Do we have that nuke, by the way? I don't really know if I've... Oh, I do have the nuke.
my invasion. Right, hold on a second, let me reclaim this. Also go ahead and build an umbrella. Come on, come on. Give me the sugar daddy stuff. Lost. We lost two? Oh, we keep building it and then it keeps getting destroyed. Right. Where's that nuke? Coming in. Might have missed. Oh, it's just super annoying. To deal with mass catapult spam. Hopefully, maybe the nuke gods will smile upon me. I mean, what, no anti-nuke. It should be a clean-cut victory. Then again, it never, it never is a clean-cut victory. So far, nothing from purple yet. If I need to, I could build an anti-nuke relatively fast. Okay, now time to shut down everything and go into maximum donger drive. Sayonara, white. That's Vidania. I will see you in another life with less catapults. Uh, there we go. Oh my god, the nightmare is over. Okay, let's get down right to basics. Your crusade has failed, friend Arino. Your crusade has failed. Damn, that guy's salt. He even spelled enemies wrong. Well, the beauty of the Annihilator can never be underestimated. So this was a little bit of an eye-opener for today, uh, guys. I did not, you know, I, I did not really, you know, um, actually kind of realized how easy it was to get onto the metal planet and then just dominate with massive amounts of eco I, I really didn't it's extremely weird I could have done things a lot better granted I was balancing two bases at once that were constantly being attacked and yeah you know, I'm not really used to that type of shit I definitely do need to be a little bit better at my micromanaging and my micromanaging was definitely terrible like I mean god awful I need to do a lot better before what it's worth I got everything down and I was able to get the Annihilator laser running and um, do some pretty good work. I feel some of the strategies my opponents employed were ludicrously retarded, but you know what? That's okay. That's their uh, philosophies. I guess I really should have abandoned my base, actually, and just let it go on autopilot, but I can't get out of the mindset I should have two bases. I don't know. Anyway, my name is Astro Alpha. Thank you guys for joining. I'll see you guys next time.